How can we make meat and leather without having animal farms? Then my answer is that, let's go back just for a second to understand where meat and leather come at the first place. Those are tissues that originates from the animal. But in order to have those products, we don't have to have the entire animal. Muscle leads to meat, skin eventually leads to leather. And so what we are trying to do is just to source the animal, to use the animal, to harvest those cells that eventually would grow up in the, in the laboratory or in the plant. No, we're not making the animal, we're making the tissue that gives rise eventually to the animal. So we, we try to make the same muscle tissue, the same skin tissue, but not with all its ingredients. Uh, we want to share the planet with the animals. But, but we don't want to compete with the animals. Right now, we're seven billion on the, on the earth and there are 60 billion animals. And by 2050, we will be nine billion and there will be about 100 billion animals. And this is just not sustainable. So we just take the cells and make the same thing as nature does without the entire animal.